it is five o'clock in the morning, or eight past five. Blooming. It's only five grams. I can weigh that. I'll have that with a small amount of water. Skull. Ready to go. Um, yeah, then I'll come back and, and I'll make my breakfast. Twenty-four-seven. Nobody else around. McDonald's over there. So Sunday morning too. Put my keys. We'll just get in. A little bit of cardio. Get out. Make sure you drink a lot of water doing this. Uh, it will just help with the rest of the day. So I've got, uh, what's that, 1.5 litres there. I'll try and nearly finish that. Uh, Dermot. <whistles> Come on, brother, how are you? Boom, here we are. Straight into it. You just go. Uh, because nobody's here, I'll just put my bag on the next one. Two eggs, and now I'll have half a carton of egg whites. I'll also use um, coconut oil to cook all my food with. Maybe that much. Yeah. Now I'll use this. Now I'll weigh out some sweet potato. This has all been pre-cooked, so I'm 13. And only for a minute. That's all this meal takes. And there it is. Very basic. Probably a week out if I was doing a bodybuilding comp, I'd, I wouldn't do legs or abs, depending on uh, how fast your recovery time is. That's the next few days, so I'll probably increase uh, carbohydrates a little bit more now. So I'll start filling out while still um, keeping my sodium low and protein at a reasonable state. Today's pretty much over. Maybe tonight I might have a little bit of carbs and tomorrow it'll start, it'll be um, Maybe, maybe a 10% increase in carbohydrates uh, per day. So right now I'm only having carbs for breakfast and lunch. So I split that um, 30 and 30. But you can't really, from here, I can't really go wrong if I stick to my diet. That's only if I start eating a lot of sugars um, and overeating. But if I stick to the basics, um, my body should take in a lot of it a lot better. Well, mate, yeah. you gotta have your shit days, have your good days. No, you didn't look rubbish. I think that was just in your head. 
I felt like crap that day. I just, I think I didn't get much sleep. Yeah. Today I've got to scrub the last bits of my tan that I had on and um, shave my full body, ready for a um, spray tan tomorrow. So, and maybe after having the massage, the deep tissue massage the first time, I was um, probably a little bit too relaxed. Um, I haven't been training as hard. And then no sleep as well has probably let me down a lot. But we're back up. Been trying to keep my sleeps to at least six hours. Still not enough, but my body's used to that. And it, and it seems to be working now. So, we've got three days. Three days. Three days. I'm fucking excited. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm Sam from Mercy Mind Therapy. Uh, we've got Rick Westman here today. Uh, we're going to give him a kind of a full body flush um, just to help prep him for his comp on Sunday, I believe. Sunday, yeah, yeah, Sunday, it's Sunday, a big day. Um, we're also going to target a bit of a myofascial release as well um, just to help, just for his muscles to kind of pretty much become a bit more prominent and um, so we can get some good muscle fibers. Yeah, We're pretty much going to be doing a um, bit of active and passive stretching as well, um, which is also going to help obviously lengthen his muscles, um, even if it's width or in kind of size. Oh, sorry. <laughs> 